Well, how do you top a amazing, amazing run that was your 100th one, where you had probably one of the shittiest scores you could imagine? You just keep doing it. And it's the 101st. And I'll probably number these in my head for a while until I uh, can't figure out exactly what number it is anymore. So yeah, that's the South African flag. If you're wondering why I'm immediately going here. Um, how we doing? How you doing? Edendale. Let's zoom in a bit to see if Edendale is a big enough city. I doubt it. Um, just quick look. That's all this is. I'm pretty sure Edendale is small. All right. That's all I'm going to do for here. <clears throat> Maybe if I go down that road a smidge. Okay, that's not going to help me. Um, oh, fucking look right behind you. The R67. How has your day been as I sit here and look for this highway? Is everything going well? Hmm. Are you eating your vegetables? Are you getting enough sunlight? We worry about you. I don't know what accent this is. I'm just kind of making it up as I go. Maybe it's English. Maybe it's just me trying to pretend to have it. It's changing now to something else. I'm going to stop. I'm starting to anger myself with it. Um. Yeah, I was watching a little bit of Twitch, which, yeah, I, I'm just going to call it TV, because honestly, that is, you can say, oh, I don't watch television. You're just replacing it with something else. There's not much of a difference. I was watching some Twitch, and Twitch is now doing that thing now where they're like, hey, we have a lot of people that watch us. We kind of have to start maybe um, diversifying our own internal options so we don't have to keep paying everybody to stream on here. And if we can just have all of the revenue come from our own internal channels, we can pocket a bit of this money. Um, that's being a bit cynical, but I think that's... Why can't I find this fucking road? That There might be a bit of truth to that. And so they're going through that stage of any television channel's growth where uh, they're now at stage... Um, well, stage one is establishment. Uh, it can last for a while because you have okay. You have an idea of what your the fuck is this place? You have an idea of what your channel is going to be, and now it's just a matter of actually finding um, your footing. Okay, the thing that we are is there an actual uh, market for it? Yes, no. Okay, we'll go from here. Graham's Town is this way. Fort Buford is that way. So it's Edensville. I should probably back up a bit here. Edendale. Let's zoom in a bit and hopefully find this thing. Um, <clears throat> so you got stage one done of, okay, we are now our channel. Hey, we're, we're established. We're doing a thing. It's great. Everyone likes this. Okay. Um, how do we keep ourselves like monetarily afloat? How do we keep interest growing? Um, in this. I don't know where the fuck Edendale is. I don't know if I'm going to find it. It's tiny enough that <clears throat> I don't know if I'll find it. So they're doing it the best way they can with the least amount of money possible, I'm assuming. Or maybe they're just f um, focusing on niche. Like, we understand our audience. They like things. We're uh, going to try to cater to that as best we can. And they're thinking, retro. Everyone likes the 80s because it's just that phase in um, middle, like, what is that perfect age demographic for 18 to 32 year olds or 36, 18 to whatever year olds. And now they're all like, yo, remember all those cartoons that were cartoons before we were born? That shit's dope. Let's watch all that. And they, uh, Brazil, because that says .br. So they're like, hey, let's just watch all these crazy cartoons from the 80s when it was all rotoscope or not the greatest quality, we'll say. I'll 
Oh, fuck you. BR-230. So this is a state, and by state I mean, um, as in state, as in the state of Brazil. Root, so it's going to be that. I don't think we're going to find... It's going to be 230, but I'm pretty sure it's got to be a big, long one to find it. So, they're watching... So, this has been the dumbest, long-winded thing to say. I was watching a bunch of old cartoons that were cartoons that I watched when I was a kid because He-Man was the shit when I was a kid. I had He-Man action figures, He-Man dolls, whatever you want to call it. Okay, this is the 230. How long is 230? Fucking... Well, it starts at Joe Piscopo, and we, uh, this is probably the longest highway in the world. This isn't going to help me. Well, I've got the highway at least, and that road was back there. We're going to go this way. Our, we're going to go this way. Thank you. <clears throat> and, um, a lot of the times that happen what happens when you watch something that you watched all the time as a kid, you realize that your, um, what you thought was like good really wasn't that good. Honestly, like adult swim had this issue a while ago cause they were doing the same thing. And, uh, they became, they, uh, purchased the rights to air a bunch of Pee Wee Herman's Playhouse. Now, as a kid, I watched the shit out of Pee Wee Herman's Playhouse because it was amazing. It had the, uh, cartoon cowboy on it, which was Morpheus in the matrix uh you can go see him with his cowboy outfit and jerry curls it's pretty great um and you watch it when you're older like hey nostalgia great we'll watch this and then you kind of are just like wait a minute this is bad this isn't very good so now i have to try to assume that where exactly this is it seems dry and arid i'm gonna assume jungles don't get dry and arid so it can't be jungle so we're over here i'm gonna click here and that's my entire basis of guessing on this i this is about the road the size of russia i'm guessing where we are here granted it had a kilometer marker on that highway thing i was ba looking back at but now i'm too lazy to go back and find it but again i keep hounding on this point about this nostalgia thing and watching he man wasn't that great a lot of the things that you embrace this nostalgia and are going back to watch again because of that you like the feelings more than the actual show itself. There's been enough time between when it actually aired and uh, the time now that you've forgotten a lot of it. Also, you were a kid, so you're not going to retain nuance as best you can now because you're older. And you'll end up just being like, I like, this, I like this thing. This thing's actually bad. Oh my god, my whole life. If you really get, like, internalized that shit. So maybe when you think, hey, remember that thing as a kid? It was great. Yeah, see, it's, I, yeah, I don't know. I got the country right. I was 30, yeah, I was like, the length, let's, let's see how, what, what country, this is like, Niger, like, go from one end of Cameroon to the other. I was that close. Um, yeah, just, I, I'm telling you a life lesson you didn't need to know, already did, and I don't know why I feel the need to address the point, but. Um, nostalgia. It's just that. And we're going to get a sign here, and it's going to tell us we're in Scandinavies. Oh, I remember. I've seen Inari before, I believe. In Kistala. I'm going to say we're in Finland. Um, I'm basing this on nothing. Okay. Other than I feel Inari was a thing I saw once before. Um, anything else I wanted to mention? Well, I just watched that and was like, well, I knew He-Man wasn't great, especially with Orko. And you're watching this stuff. I'm like, I just, it was entertaining because it was bright and colorful, had flashing lights. You saw how, God, what the hell was the tiger's name? Whenever it would transform, it had, like epileptic inducing flashing lights when it would transform into the giant rideable tiger it had. And I don't know why, like, thinking about it now, instantaneously, I've not really read up much in the lore of He-Man after I grew out of watching it, that, you know, that tiger, <clears throat> excuse me, that tiger he had as a pet was always, like, super scared of everything, but the second he transformed into that big giant fucking mount, he was just, like, 
turned into just this well maybe not mindless but he, he never talked to you and he roared and shit it was like why didn't he just ever stay that way he was like super strong powerful didn't give a shit but you know he would just always be like that little cowardly tiger lion whatever you want to call it. where the fuck is this 80 81 83 I mean we're dancing around this here I'm going to click 81. It's like, does it share? Okay, here's 80. Um, Inari and Kistala. Let's take a look for... Can I find Inari or Kistala anywhere up here? I don't know. I also have this thought, too, when it comes to coming back to a game that you quit a while ago, and a lot of this has, like, uh, revolves around... MMOs, if any of those things, if anybody plays those anymore, because they're kind of just a dying genre. And you play one for a while, then you quit, and then, hey, you're kind of like, eh, I kind of want to play this again, but you got to remember you quit these things for a reason. Why? Oh, because it's doing that. Okay, key stall. Well, this is going to give me a bit of a. So, Dan Clea. Well, actually, this is still staying. Actually, the sign, I want to see that sign down there, because that potentially is going to say what highway we're about to switch to, I think. Nope, it's just... Oh, here we go. All right, all right. This is going to help me in the 50 seconds I got left. Like, I could have... Okay, it is... This is the 80, and it goes to Sodan, Clea, and Kitty, Kitty, Kitty Litter. Kitty Law is this way. And then Sodan Klaia is this way. I'm butchering your language. You're just probably used to it by now, but honestly, I'm I'm not doing it on purpose. Kitty Lat okay, what about so dang I'm not seeing dank anywhere here. Oh there it is. So we're connecting to it somewhere in the middle here. I'm not seeing a road. I'm gonna click here. Am I seeing a road anywhere that it can connect to? I'm is it like right here? No, it was all the way up there. Oh, God, I did the thing. I didn't want to do the thing. Hit the button again. All right. Apologies. Again, not giving anything scores because I feel it may influence the next one I get, and I want it to be as random as possible. That's my excuse. Um, this is Ireland. Or Scotland. I want to say that's jail, but I'm I'm basing this off of jail used to be spelled with a G, and that's keys on a sign. But that's that's really nothing. That's nothing I can really confidently say. I know. Lagenhaugen, Langhaugen. Maybe this sign will help me. Opland Flyke, Nord. God, this is like. Now I don't even think this is England. Like, Langenhaugen can... See, when I... This is the thing I wish all photos are in this game, is you can zoom in this well, and you can make out the goddamn sign very easily. Nord is a French thing. Well, when they say North, East, South, West, it's Nord... Est said West, but I'm sure Nord is not just a French thing. Oh boy, this one might, might, I think we're almost at the score we were at last time. Okay, Radio P1. This, like, is really throwing me for one hell of a loop. Like, none of this, this, this follows no verbal pattern. These... Low, really sparse trees makes me feel like we're super fucking north. Like Falkland Islands north. Because, but they also have different types of trees here too. And I'm a bit concerned that this is just going to be the extent of this entire road. Gall 20, like 51. Alright, let's get over here. Look for 51. Does any of these things say 50, 50? Okay, that one does not, so it's not Wales. 
51. Those don't. This is what I've been boiling this down to. R46. Nope. Gall. Like, I don't know what gall is. Gold. Is, is it, is it Scottish? Like, I'm, I don't know. I'm looking for any sort of, like, um, a feral, no, Falkland, I'm thinking feral, it's not fucking Falkland, I'm an idiot. 51, 58, I'm not seeing, see, okay, they follow kind of the, um, Icelandic, I got a minute left, I am going to start panicking. Hmm. Well, this is, like, everything screams Scandinavia here. I'm not seeing any accents on any of the words. All those coat of arms things makes me feel like this is England. Um, we're going to look at this car, because thankfully we actually have a vehicle. And they're driving on the non-English side, so now I feel... Um, there's moose here. This is baffling. Are we like... Man, I'm going to get a really bad score in this one. Nothing makes sense. I got to click. I'm just going to do Norway. This is going to be so far off. I didn't deserve this. <laughs> Nothing on this made me even think of this. Uh, why am I clicking there? That's that's not where it's supposed to go. Oh, God. Okay. Wow. This one. This one got me. Oh, well, if I thought about it, Finland had kind of the same number thing, just in different colors. Fuck me. I didn't deserve that. Oh, it wasn't the end. I thought it was. Uh, Cabana. This is probably... I don't know. I got my so mentally taxed on that one. Look at me just complain. Mentally taxed on that last one. Ricon Del Mar. Well, I'm going to just click in the Brazil somewhere. I'm not going to find anything here to help me. I'm pretty... Well, fuck. Okay. So, good thing I went backwards. Because that is Colombia. That is not Colombia. That's like 75. Is that Pac Man with a hat on and hair? Copyright infringement. Well, we're in Colombia. Can I just look around a bit and see what the. Well, I can't really tell. Um. Well, I'm already. In the right country. The problem is finding anything else out. Hmm. That's a really interesting looking pine uh, pine tree. Palm tree. Like, you know, you could branch your branches out in a different way, but it also is a very primitive plant compared to the other ones. I think ferns, palm trees are super old. As far as plants go, I'm not a botanist, so if I'm wrong, please tell me. Does this feel like Oceanside? Well, we have water here. I don't know if this was put here by people or if we're on a quote-unquote... Well, I don't know if there's actually mangroves in Colombia. I'm just going to click here. I mean, I'm, I'm, I got the country. What more do you want? Probably cities. This is a bit of a developed area here. That's why, why is that there? Is that like a, okay, this, this may help me. Well, it says Feliz Navidad. Okay. The ocean is literally right there. Okay. Um, it is the festival of the sun and Mar bodies on a plate. Rincon del Mar. I'm going to spend a bit of time maybe seeing if Rincon... Rincon del... I'm saying that so badly. 
Rakan Del Mar is anywhere on the map here. Uh, Gerardo, Niqui, Buena, Guapi, Tumaco. We're going to zoom in a bit. Um, hmm. I'm, I'm assuming that Rincon Del Mar is the actual name of the uh, town here on the ocean. Is there like a giant lake in the middle of the country? I mean, there is a lake, but I don't think... I think this is ocean. So, let's see. I've got... I got 30 seconds. Okay, that's... I'm going to click here. Look for Racon Del Mar, just in case. Nope. Nope. Um, they we're not in there. Santa Maria, no, that's, no. All right. I think I'm happy. Well, I've got the country. It's probably up here. And I'm not going to unclick it. Yeah, it was up there. I was right. Well, oh, it's ring cone right there. All right. Okay. Got the country right. And I got 21,000. Jesus. I didn't deserve any of that from that one. Not at all. But I don't think I deserved some of the options that I had in the last game. So I'm going to take this and run with it. And uh, thank you all for watching the 101st episode of this. Maybe it's even called this season two. I don't know. What the fuck are seasons? I'm just making these things. But again, thank you all for watching. If you could like, favorite, comment, subscribe. I know I asked a couple of things out of you today. I don't remember exactly what they are right now because I have no memory anymore. Uh, if you can remind me by giving me the answer to whatever I was asking, I'd appreciate it. I appreciate all of you and the time you give to this. But until next time, um, thank you all for watching. Maybe check out some of the other stuff I got going on. It's kind of just going to be, you know, this three days a week, and then whatever I do on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Since it's just me for, Christ, who knows how much longer, probably forever. Um, we're kind of flying at the seat of our pants till I actually realize what the hell I'm going to do on those other days. But that's enough of this extra. Goodbye.